Hey, I think we should get to my favourite part of the week. It's the... Big Bad Wall! Oh, yeah, Freya, what do you say? Will you read some posts with me? Oh, my gosh, 100%. Well, this is how it works, Freya. We have, until we hear this sound, <laughs> to get through as many bits of post as we possibly can. You guys going to count me in? Yeah. Three, two, yeah. one! Let's see, we'll start over here. This is Oliver, who's 11, photographed with Finding Her Feet, which is the book of the month at the minute. Badge on the way to you for reading. Nice work. This is Scarlett, who's 10, and she drew the book cover of Finding Her Feet, which we will be finding out a little bit more about that book later on in the show. There's a badge on the way to you too. I love it. Have a look at Daisy here, who loves football so much that she recently joined a girls football team. Keep it up, we love it, Daisy. Oh, we have a junior Eurovision fan here. This is eight-year-old Abigail who drew the Stand Unique Girls. Hopefully you'll be watching on the weekend. Woo. Love it. Have a look at this. This comes in from Holly. It's a poster that says, be the best you in the world. Be yourself. Amazing, amazing message. <laughs> oh, we're all out of time with Freya. Thank you so much for doing that with me. Did you have fun? Oh, my goodness. It's so fun, especially because of all these amazing drawings and artwork. It's amazing. It's such good stuff. Thank you to everyone who sent something in. And if you haven't got a Blue Peter badge yet, then make sure you get in the Blue Peter website. You can get yours. All the info is there. And check out one of these as well, our new book badge. You can read our book of the month, which is, as you saw earlier, Finding Your Feet. And if you don't know much about that book, then have a look at this. We've come to Hull City Football Club to review our next BB Book Club, Finding Her Feet by Eve Ainsworth, and illustrated by Luna Valentine. Here's what it's all about. Lily always felt a bit left out, especially at school where all the other girls seemed so confident. That's until her PE teacher spots her natural talent on the football pitch and invites her to join the local girls team. Just as Lily finally feels like she's fitting in, an argument with her teammates puts everything at risk. Hmm. Can Lily carry on playing the game she loves? To review the book are BB Book Clubbers. Madison, Matilda, Darcy, Amelia, Daisy, Francesca and Elise. I can't wait to hear what they thought about the book. Book Clubbers, we are at Hull City Football Ground and you lot all play for a team, right? Yeah. That is pretty cool. Well, what do you think about this football-related book? It's quite inspiring because it, like, teaches us how to, like, treat people in our team. What else do people like about the book? I like that the PE teacher realised that she was good. The writing was all spread out and not crammed together. It's, like, really good for dyslexic people. Yeah, it's on the yellow-tinged paper, and I found it really easy to read. I feel like the pictures, it helped me, it helped me because then I knew what was going on in the story. So was there anything in the book that we didn't quite like? I didn't like like that she didn't have as much confidence as she should when her dad was telling her that she's real good. So it's a real lesson in being confident in yourself and really believing in yourself. It told me not just the story, but it told me facts from where, like, women's football started and how it is now. And it really does make you appreciate the women's football a lot more. Just like Lily and her football team, these girls all play together in a club. So let's see them in action and get a little taster of the book. Lily had space, so she moved fast taking care to keep the ball close to her feet. Lily struck the ball. She didn't dare look as her heart lifted along with the shot. Had she made a mistake, the ball curled and looked as if it might be dipping into the top corner. But then at the last moment, the ball clipped to the bar and spun over. Lily froze, frightened that her teammates might be cross at her for missing. But instead, they rushed over to her, their faces bright with smiles. Great reading, girls. Now, let's see what some of our other BP book clubbers thought of the book. The reason why I like this book is because it's all about perseverance and a girl that likes football. I like Lily because she was brave. My favourite character was the dad because the dad shows and tells Lily that you can do anything. I like this because it shows even if you're not that confident and shy, you should still do the things you love. I think the, the yellow paper encouraged me to read this book because it was a lot easier to read and also it was spaced out. I liked the fact that there was the facts and the non-fiction facts. 
think that was really nice because I learned new things too. My favourite character was Lily, but she always tried her best. I don't think anything could have made this book better. The way it was laid out and the story was told was just amazing. So, who were your favourite characters and did you relate to them at all? I like Beth because uh, she, as soon as she like saw Lily, she made her feel welcome and made her one of her friends, so she had someone to always kick about with. I like Lily because she was really kind and really nice to other people. So what would you do if you met someone like Lily? I like to make them feel quite welcomed and make sure that they have a good time. So what have you learned from reading this book? I've learned that if there's anyone new in the team, to treat them um, equally to everyone else. I've learned that when my dad like, tells me that I'm good at football to listen to him. I've learned that if I'm ever worried that I can tell a good trusted adult, either like my PE teacher, my coach, or even like my parents, and they'll help me. Well, we have loved hearing what you have to say about the book. Thanks, book clubbers. Have you enjoyed yourself? Yeah! Look at those football skills. And if you want some more book club action, then head to the Blue Peter website. Now,